Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If it's your first time here, then hey, welcome. And if you're a turning viewer, then hey, what's popping? So today's video, as y'all can tell by the title, is gonna be a story time. I haven't done one in a minute. You know, I miss story times. It's outside of my channel on story times. So this story time, it's gonna be about the time, like I felt like it was an attempt at arranged marriage because everybody was moving crazy. <laughs> everybody was moving funny. Okay, so. This was 2015 when I was in South Sudan. So I was already thinking like anything's possible. Like I was walking around on eggshells. I thought everybody was like out to get me. Anything that anybody said, I always thought they were lying. Cause it's like, you lied for me to get here. So what the hell, what else can you be lying about? Towards the end of the year, like 2015. So I was at home, my granddad's house, you know, chilling, killing, you know, drug dealing. And then, um, couple like relatives came over random people came over to like just you know Sudanese is not bad anybody over you can come have tea chill so like if you're the brother sisters cousin nephews uncles best friends dog dog's owner uncle's sister blah 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 you could come over like they didn't really they weren't strict on who could come over to the house this man this old 65, 68, 70 something looking old man came over and we made him tea. He spoke with my granddad, everybody's conversating, and I'm just like sitting down. And so I'm just there sitting down, you know. I'm like 16 at the time, so like I was naive. He's like, What's your name? And like South Sudanese, they ask for your name or God, as if they want you or they don't want you. So he's like, hey, John, man. I'm like, and I'm like, chill out. He's like, chill out, man. Like, chill out, man. Like, chill He was like, hey, yeah, Joe. I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then he's like, who do I get here? I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, what's up? Because that's around the time when I first learned, like, what's related to me, you know, what kind of what tribe I'm in or whatever. Like, I knew I was a god, but I didn't know like young and all that. So yeah, I was like cocky with it. I'm like, yeah, 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 what's up? Mm-hmm, yeah. So um, he really basically knew because like he was at my granddad's house and that's like, what's related? That's like, I'm related to what my granddad's related to. So I take by my granddad. I take after. I take after my granddad. So I said, yeah, 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 blah, blah. He's like, oh, okay. And then he said his name or whatever. One in one ear and out the next. So yeah, got sidetracked. Um, what was that too? So yeah, he basically already knew like I'm the granddaughter of so and so, or like the daughter, whatever. So yeah. And then he was like, mm, okay, yeah, yeah. And then everybody's chilling, he's doing whatever he's doing. I don't know. I wasn't paying attention. I'm chilling. And then he proceeds to be like Yan, Yan on Gorbat, Yan I said, Dinga, is that on Gorbat, on Gor, on Gorbat, Yan Dia? Or if you're Twitch or whatever, Twitch and Witch Bat, Yan Dia. If you're Bor and Korbat, Yan Dia, whatever. Basically translating like, I want you to be my wife. I said, Ding Du. He's like, Yeah. I'm like, Yan. Yeah. I was just like, Look at him, like, I know you're lying, like, stop the cap. He's like, no, you can't be my wife. What's, what's, what's the matter? I'm like, no, it's not that. It's just I'm, I'm very young, I'm Korean, and I'm mid. And like, I went one month to school. Even though I wasn't going to school for like four months, three, four months. So it's like, I was capping. Yeah, I'm like, again, I'm on school. Yeah, I'm good, but God, by the door, full cap. My cousin was there at the time. So she was laughing, going, I got to put her with me. <laughs> so like yeah she was laughing her ass off she's screaming I'm there like it's not funny it's not funny stop like I lost all the color in my face even though that's not possible because like I'm still black yeah and he's like anyways kitchen red can yin in gorbat yang de and grant you with jam yeah man now we you know yeah and I'm being your belly like woody I'm gonna tell your granddad that I'm proposing to your wife. I mean, okay. I am making. I'm proposing to your granddaughter, and 
Oh, I'm gonna be like, oh, I'm gonna be like, oh, I'm gonna Guys, if, guys, guys, the way my heart was beating, I'm like, he, got, he has to be lying because you don't even know me. He's like, hey, I like you like that. Mm, I'm like, 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 I said, so when I was cleaning or whatever the hell I was doing, you really do love at me, you really tell me like you had feelings. You mean a seven-year-old self? He's like, yeah. To go and eat here, piante, piante, yeah, good column. Yeah, go and eat in, 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 gar, whatever. Say about the broken thinker. I'm like, okay, cool. I'm like, okay, whatever, cool. In my brain, but I'm still telling him, like, it's not possible. In, in, like, in, in, but, but, I'm like, about the tear. Yeah, what do you do? Like, maybe somebody your age, your age. And then he's like, "Amu, I'm with my ten core chidi, chidi, more than ten chidi, but um, but yet to you, cause why, why do you catch it a bit yet? Kinda say like, I want a young, fresh, naive, virginated, that's what I want, just young virgin looking girl like you, so you can give me the kids that I need." Guys. When I tell you, I was stressed because it's like everybody was just watching me like reply to him. No one wanted to back me up. No one was trying to help me quote back going. People were like, look at me like, you gonna say yes or, or what? I said, no, no, the hell I'm not. Okay, cool. So that happened, and then I was really irritated, so I like stormed off, and I was doing like house tours or whatever. A couple like minutes later. I mean, like 20 minutes later, he's still there eyeing me. Yeah, yeah, little thing. I go this side. Yeah, little thing. I walk to the room. Yeah, little thing. Just everywhere I go, he's like looking at me. Looking at me. Looking at me. Looking at me. Okay, cool. I came back. He's like, anyways, can you can we belly? Like what I want to tell you. I'm like, we belly. Like, what else do you have to tell me right now? Guys. Me. <laughs> Let me get cute. You know what he said? You know what this uncle, granddad, Baba, Papa said? He's like, he would be dead apart. Murduna and Murdia. Do con your granddad. Translation, translation, translation. Your vagina. No. Your punani or your your cookie is mine. Don't you ever give it to anybody else. Me and my 16 year old self, I was so innocent. I'm like, I wanna go home. Even though I'm home, I wanna go home. I felt violated. I felt like hypersexualized. I'm like, he did not just say that. My cousin is still screaming. She's so happy with her life. She's like, Mark with that says she was screaming. I was there offended. And then he's like, you know how those um African guys like think they're cute? They they can be cute but they think by doing this the extra cute like how they lick their lips and like make eye contact like that. And then they bite their lip. So this uncle, this granddad, he thought he was doing something. After he said that, and I was just there like yeah he goes he proceeds to lick his lips he's like and then he bites like the whole chin like basically all here because he has no bottom teeth so he's like like there he's like and then he's like looking at me like trying to be sexy he's like like dead ass he's trying to be like sexy and then like I was there like, I know you have to be on drugs or something because you did not just do that. Looking at me all sexy and everything is like, hey, good deal. You go and get around that. Don't, don't you ever in your life try to. After that, that was the last straw. I got my shit. Whatever the hell was next to me. I didn't have a friend at the time. And I stormed in the room because we were outside. Like, like on chairs, plastic chairs and everything. I got myself, I stormed in the room and I closed the door. I'm like, no. 
I am not about to be victimized. <laughs> I am not about to be treated in that manner. I rebuke, I refuse. <laughs> but I was so angry. I wasn't angry, angry, but I was just there like, can more I could do? How did you have the balls to say that for real, for real? My guy that wasn't there at the time, I feel like he was talking to other people. Like, there's so many people at the house, so he hadn't heard that, but like, Later on that day, he went to joke about like, oh, how's your Mwindu wall? I thought, Mwinga? Mwinyanya? The one, your friend? He's like, no, 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 Mwindu. Mwinyanya, Wigi. A wall? Check that man toward there? I said, you're disrespectful? Look at my cousin. You ain't shit for not backing me up. And I just went about my day. Went about my day. So, that's the end of the story time. I hope you guys had a laugh because I was traumatized like that I like he really tried it this uncle this is the definition of trauma this is the definition of trauma for real, for real. like him and his yellow teeth just smiling it like Sorry? Oh, Jesus.